Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Belgium against the United States. The instructions will have been clear from the managers, Derek. Stick to the game plan. Don't take risks in your defending third and embrace the occasion. Don't be frightened of it. What a game this should be. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Jan Vertonghen starts with Toby Alderweireld in central defence. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Yuri Tielemans in the centre of midfield. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Can someone get on the end of this? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Vigorous defending. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. McKenney just couldn't capitalise there. astute piece of defending well the attacking options appear plentiful can he take advantage well hit with power but shame about the placement Salamakers return to Tielemans can he open them up here and effectively parried away by the keeper and relief as the keeper holds on well he reacts so quickly doesn't he that's a great bit of work from him Belgium being afforded too much space significant well as the replay shows this is all about his ability to find space in the box which then makes the finish look so much easier that's good play from him Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Now that attack going up a dead end, and the keeper has the ball. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. He'll be kicking himself. Well, the opportunity presented itself, and they really should be level. They have to be more composed, more clinical, if they want to get back into this. Untidy it was by Meunier. Promising sequence. Lukaku! Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. 
Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by stringing a few passes together. Getting the better of his opponent. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. Well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Not all that convincing defensively. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. It's got to be a Belgium throw-in. Tielemans and continues his run Lukaku options in the middle top class defending can they hit on the break Pulisic excellent refereeing advantage in operation well, as things turned out, no advantage accrued to them, and she's awarded the free kick. Well, he can consider himself admonished, even in the absence of a yellow card. Well, no surprise to see him go for goal, but a routine save in the end. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Teammates available. Adams. Tremendous block. And Pulisic has it. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Alert defending. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Well, finally, it goes out of play, and the pressure was there from the start. Jorge Mihailovic. Running with the ball confidently. Can he put it away? Safe pair of hands, did his job. Regained possession. Can he finish? Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Great pressure to win the ball back. I must say, this looks promising. And they do like to press whenever they can. Lukaku. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Tielemans. Wonderful chance. Oh, it's a goal. A celebratory moment as they jump in front. Well, let's look at that again. I'm almost lost for words here, Derek. It's really sloppy defending. You can't be giving the ball away in such a dangerous area like that and not expect to get punished. It's just really poor.
So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Tielemans. A sloppy pass. Pulisic. Weston McKinney. He's in with a chance. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Well, Belgium aren't controlling the possession here, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Kevin De Bruyne. And now here's Aidan Azar. Well, sadly, a bit of a tame effort, that one. And far too close to the goalkeeper. Weston McKenney. Yunus Musa. And now they have the ball back. Tielemans. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Tielemans. Very quick thinking there. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And back underway, the ball is moving again, with Belgium looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance. Committed challenge. Well, no stopping him. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Alexis Salamakers. And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Adams. Can he find the right pass? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Into the advanced position. Delightful pass. Can they stop it going in? Oh, the penalty's been given, and it's not what they had in mind. It's falling apart for them. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referees got that right all round. It was a penalty, and it was a yellow card. <laughs> to extend their lead here. Couldn't grab hold of it. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Yunus Musa. And that was a very fine read. Real chance. Well, that was a gilt-edged opportunity for the equaliser. Well, I'm not sure how he's missed the target from there. That's a poor effort. Alderweireld. Well, that is how to play advantage. That'll be a throw-in for Belgium. And a chance to whip it in here. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. 
and doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live one. And in with a real chance. Oh, must be. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Adams. The players waiting in the centre. Can they nudge in front? Oh, it's in to give them the lead in the final. The stuff that dreams are made of. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. And Belgium get us moving again. A quick reply required after the disappointment of conceding. Lukaku. Here's Tielemans. Moving into the advanced position. And couldn't keep himself onside. They've given it away. Giovanni Reina well he so badly wants that hat-trick Stuart well that was the chance for the hat-trick but the way he's playing he's surely going to get it today well had that gone in they would be in complete control of this game as it is they're still going to be a bit nervy and after that fantastic effort it's gone out for a throw-in Musa Adams just couldn't capitalize there counter-attacking very much an option well it fizzled out De Bruyne a chance to whip it in this looks more than decent getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Superb effort to keep it in. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. Weston McKenney. And threading it forward. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now?
just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Just 15 minutes remaining. Aidan Azar moving the ball effectively. And it was a good looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Throw into Belgium then. Kevin De Bruyne. He has teammates around him. Carrasco. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Brendan Aronson. Really good challenge. Lukaku. Lukaku! Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Who can they pick out? Well, full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, threat over for now. Vertonghen. Alert defending. Roldan. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. He's got to score. There's the goal. Surely now that is that. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And so into the final five minutes. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And over the touchline, throw for Belgium here. Mertens. And now here's Aidan Azar. Will it be Lukaku? And the ball brought down under no real pressure. And there the attack ends for now. And a tidy challenge. Incision with the pass from Kevin De Bruyne. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, as the replay shows us, Kevin De Bruyne picks out the pass to beat that defensive line, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Not a scoreline we see all that often, 5-3. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Who can he pick out? And making the move to the inside. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? Corner kick forthcoming.
And over it comes. Well, not cleared away completely. Well, feeding it back to the goalkeeper. Promising move. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made.